today's Silver Hunt Sunday, I went by the antique market and I picked up a couple of beautiful Canadian half dollars. And it was such a nice day, I made sure I filmed outside. Remember to check out my website, CanadianSilverSaver.com, for my products, others from the community, and my wife's wonderful artwork. And follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, Tumblr, and even Pinterest now. And a very special thank you to MetalsMafia.com for your support on this video. Welcome back everybody, Canadian Silver Saver here, and it is my first Silver Hunt Sunday outside of the 100 days of silver stacking. Mrs. Canadian Silver Saver is beside us too, so it's just such a nice day. We were at the market today, and uh, I thought I'd stay outside and show everybody what I grabbed at the market. Not a whole lot, it wasn't an overly successful hunt, uh, which kind of changed some of the vendors, and as we got there, there was an accident up the road, and they somebody took out a hydro pole, and knocked out all the power at the market so we couldn't uh, couldn't hit the old bank machine there so kind of kind of silly but you know that happens so let's show you what I picked up here so I had a couple of things from the one guy let's see if I can get this better get this in the lighting here there you go I'm doing this outside because uh, it's just so nice today you might hear some background noise there's a car right now but uh, Really, really good shape with that 19, uh, 1958. Beautiful condition. I need a lot of these, actually. Um, I could have picked up quite a few more if I had more money in my pocket, more cash in my pocket. Currency. So there's that one there. Very nice, really good condition. And then the 57 is in an even nicer shape. And uh, I don't think these are cleaned. They don't look clean to me. Uh, he was pretty adamant that we're... And I, I agree, like, I think they look nice. But, uh, there we go. Really, really nice uh, condition. Not worn down at all. No, no real toning on it. Just really, really nice. Said he got these from a guy in a few tubes. So I think they've just been kept... Set away for a long time. Really happy with those pickups, uh, especially with the year being uh, pre-60s. A lot of times they're just really worn down. Um, yeah, so I was happy with that. Two of those. And being such a nice day out, I couldn't resist but be out here. Last time we were outside like this was our uh, Libertad one. So make sure you check out my In the Sun Libertad video there. And my 100 days of silver stacking is over now, but i uh, got lots of things that I'm going to have planned for upcoming upcoming videos. and. Hopefully you guys will check that out. Make sure you check out my playlist for Silver Hunt Sunday as well. Those are always really popular. So, a bit of a glare here. I'm having a hard time seeing. But <laughs> I know the camera's working. Cool. Well, thanks everybody. Thanks for all your support in the videos. And make sure you head on over to my website to uh, you can make purchase the t-shirts and make donations to the JDRF. I'm raising money to help find a cure. The walk's coming up on June 11th. So it's exciting. And... Uh, doing all right with some of the t-shirt sales and then this week um, hopefully tomorrow or Tuesday my website will be fully launched to have a proper store and you'll just be able to make purchases there and I've got some cool items on there as well so all right take care everybody been a lot of fun and uh, we'll see you later in the week Canadian Silver Saver 